Hello and welcome to lesson two. In this lesson, I want to show you and to prove to you that wealth does not discriminate against people. So many people are wealthy, not because they are strong physically. There are some people, they are blind, yet they are rich. Some are disabled, they don't have legs, yet they are rich. Some, they are sick in the body, yet they are rich. Some are HIV positive, yet they are rich. You see, some, you see, you will be surprised at the sickness that some are facing, and yet they are stupendously rich. That tells you that riches does not answer to strong body. There are so many strong-bodied people, able-bodied people, who are wallowing in abject poverty, and whereas people with weak bodies are, you know, enjoying wealth. If wealth is, you know, if wealth truly is um, um, confined to certain people, then that means that weak people will not be rich. And let me tell you, wealth does not have to do with whether you are a male or female. I've seen so many females who are richer than male. So wealth does not discriminate against people, against gender, against your strength or your beauty or lack of it. There are so many people who are beautiful who are wallowing in abject poverty. And yet, some people who are not even beautiful are really enjoying stupendous wealth. So wealth is not in all this. Then wealth is not in where you live. Some people think, if I can just go to town, whereas in the village, some people are becoming very rich. In some rich countries, there are so many poor people in rich countries. And there are so many poor, I mean, poor people, you know, there are so many poor people in rich countries. And there are so many rich people in poor countries. So traveling to a country does not guarantee wealth. So there must be somewhere else where wealth comes from. And where is that place? It's from the inside of a man. Because wealth is not in a, in a, in a job. If not, maybe all the, all, the, all the doctors will be wealthy. Maybe all the lawyers will be wealthy. But it's not like that. Whereas we see some people selling common things, becoming very wealthy, and yet we see some people who went to years of training in the university and yet they are not wealthy. So wealth must be from something different from your profession, different from your location, different from your physical ability. It must be from the inside of you. Wealth is generated from the inside of a man. And that is what I want to show you in this course. Thank you for listening. See you in the next lesson.